Welcome to my video. This is Barbie Figueroa with personalbrandingforprofit.com. Hello, Thrive Theme Enthusiasts. This video is for you. And um, actually, this video is to respond to a question that I received via email. So I'm actually responding directly to one of my subscribers who asked me this question via email. And I have to say it is something that had puzzled me for the longest time as well, but I have an answer for you today. So get ready because if you've ever wanted to learn how to change the color of your Thrive Themes footer, then keep on watching. Alright guys and gals, if you haven't done so already, make sure to visit my website at www.personalbrandingforprofit.com and download my free online business toolkit. I've compiled an awesome online starter toolkit to let you know all the tools that I've used to automate a lot of my marketing in my business and how I've built my business online and how you can do it too. So make sure to enter your name and your best email and, and I will let you have the toolkit, alright? So today's video is a challenge okay uh let's go ahead and go to my dummy site that i saw thrive theme squared okay and you'll see that out of the box it comes out like this and you've got you know the black footer and you know it's kind of boring and etc cetera, etc cetera, which is why you hire a designer to make your website pretty right so uh, but still, you know, uh, in Thrive Themes, it comes out of the box just the way it is. Now, you can go ahead and click on the Customize button, right? And you can do certain customizations. You can change the font colors here, and you can change, like, the font style. You can change some colors, but you can change the background, link color, headline text, body text color. Um, you can change the colors in the header, right? and uh but you really can't change the color of the footer right and the only other place that you can um customize thrive themes and let me go to my dashboard i'm going to show you this is you can go to the thrive theme options and you have a few uh color um style and layout let's say you have just a few color options right so if I save changes and I go ahead and I open up my site, okay, and I visit the site, you know, um, it changes these things to purple, okay, but there's no real uh, change to the footer, right? You can change it to red, it'll change the color scheme, but uh, if you want to change the header, you have to go back into the customize, change the colors, etc. And then here it'll change like the little details. Okay, let's click save. And uh, let's go visit the site. And you'll see that now that changes things to red. But if you really want to like, you know, um, you deck this out, you need to know design. And you need to know how to uh, work around this. But... There's been one mystery and even it stumped me, which is how to change the footer, right? How to change the footer color because the footer color really doesn't change. You can't really customize it. But I finally discovered how to change the footer color and I was like, I have just got to share this with my followers because I know this is gonna save you a ton of time. Now, before I give you uh, the answer to how to change the color of your Thrive Themes footer, I want you to know this, okay? This is one of the benefits of having a Thrive Themes license. I am going to tell you right now, if you don't know, and I think I've mentioned this on my channel before, I am not a coder. I am not a programmer, okay? But I design branded websites for a living. How is that possible? Well, because anything that has to do with uh, coding or anything like that, I usually outsource it if it's something that's too complicated for me. But 
you know, I'm more of a branding consultant. I understand how to sh tell your brand story and I'm very visual. So I know how to create that feeling that I want to create, but I don't do custom programming. Okay. Or CSS programming. All right. So that's why I depend on using really awesome themes like Thrive Themes as my framework or Divi as a framework uh, to build my art around. Okay, so I'm not the kind of designer that will build a WordPress theme from scratch, right? So I'm always looking for shortcuts too that don't really require coding. In this particular instance, you need to know uh, some coding in order to change the footer. So the benefit of having a Thrive Themes license is that you do have access to their support system. They have an amazing support system. I can open up a ticket, ask a question, and within 24 hours, I usually have an answer and uh, because of that, I, I was able to bring this to you. Now, I'd love to say that I came up with this CSS coding myself, but again, I'm not a coder. I am not a coder, which is why I depend on Thrive Themes and Divi uh, to create that beautiful framework and then I can just design around their platforms, okay? So I'm sure I'm not the only one. <laughs> so, but let's get down to the nitty gritty. How do you change the footer? Well you do need CSS coding, okay? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to my dashboard and we're going to go to the Thrive Themes option, okay? Right here under Style and Layout Settings, you can add custom CSS coding, okay? Now for this particular instance, I want to change the footer color to my uh, signature magenta color, which I use on all my branding, okay? So, if you look below this video, I'm going to include the CSS coding, okay? And it'll also be on the blog at personalbrandingforprofit.com. I'm going to, you know, blog about this as well. So you can go check it out there. I'll have a link to the blog post as there. I'll have a link to the blog post there as well. But you're going to need to copy this little uh, snippet of coding into the custom CSS section under the Thrive Themes Options under Style and Layout Settings, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and click on save and that'll change the entire color of the footer. Let's go ahead and open this. And now my footer has changed. And that is it, it's as easy as that. So if this video helped you, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you like videos like this and you wanna learn more about how to build your business online using tools and technology and automation, um, and learn some cool web design tricks as well, then go ahead and make sure you subscribe to my channel. And again, if you haven't done so already, head on over to my website at personalbrandingforprofit.com and download my online business toolkit. Now, I do wanna let you know that I've got some training courses in the works, so make sure to stay subscribed to my channel. Uh, I've got a lot of cool things coming down the pipeline, so I, I want to help as many people as possible, you know, uh, simplify this whole sometimes complicated internet marketing world so you can grow your brand and grow your business online. So this has been Barbie Figueroa. I hope this helps you, and I'll see you on the next video. Don't let design and tech frustration keep you from building your dream business online. I got you covered. Visit my website now and download my free online business welcome toolkit and discover how to ditch the drama of launching your business on the internet. You'll instantly receive a list of my must-have tools, learn how I launched my own business online, and how we can work together to breathe life into your business. I'll also help you solve the seemingly complicated puzzle pieces of online marketing and you'll learn exactly why your website is the center of your marketing universe and how to convert it into the most valuable asset in your business that keeps working for you. So forget the tech and design frustration and leave all the fun stuff to us. Make sure to visit my website at www.personalbrandingforprofit.com and download your free online business toolkit today.